Welcome back to my channel. In this tutorial, I will be showing you how to navigate in Flutter using Go Router package. Go Router package is a declarative routing package for Flutter that uses the router API to provide a convenient URL based API for navigating between different screens. So in this tutorial, we will be using this Go Router package, which you can find in pub.dev. Next, let's install this package into our Flutter project. To prevent any version error, make sure you are using the same environment SDK as mine. Here, I have created a very simple Flutter application that only has an elevated button and I will navigate when the elevated button is pressed. To navigate between screens in Flutter, firstly, we need to create our routes. Here, I will create a file that mainly store all the routes. So here, we will create a Go Router instance and that instance will hold all the routes. Don't forget to import the Go Router package. And for each Go route, it takes a path and a builder. Path is a URL to that route, and the builder will return the widget for that path. Basically, it's the screen when we route to that path. So in this tutorial, I will create three paths and navigate between them. Now we need to create the screen for another two routes, which is home and setting screen. Here we have created a very simple UI for the home screen and don't forget to go back to the routes file and import the screen. Next, I will do the same thing for setting screen. So here we have created three routes and each route will have a path and each route will return different screen. So routes is done. Now we can navigate in our app. But before that, we need to add the Go Router instance to our material app. So in our run app function, instead of returning a home widget, we will use material app.router and add go router instance in the router config. So now our home material app have the access to the route file that we created. Last step, which is to add the navigation function in the on press elevated button. So to navigate using go router, 
we can call go router dot of contacts dot go and specify the location URL. And the location value is the path URL that we created in our routes file. So here we have added a navigation from my app screen to home screen. Next, we will be adding another navigation function from home screen to the setting screen. And in the home screen, we navigating to the setting screen. Make sure you double check the URL path is the correct as we set up in the routes file. Other than using go router dot of context to route, we can actually simplify it by just using the context dot go and specify the URL path. It will do the same work. Now let's hot restart the Flutter application and see if the redirection works. And as you can see, when I click on the elevator button, we are redirected to the home page. And when we click on the elevator button in the home page, we are redirected to the setting page. So this is how we navigate between screens in Flutter using Go Router package. Here comes to the end of the tutorial. If you have any question, feel free to comment below. If you like our video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel. See you in the next tutorial.